everyone. So it was requested that I do more Doctor Who based ASMR videos and I thought that was a fantastic idea. So I thought it would be quite fun if we had a little look through some old Battles in Time cards. Now I actually bought these on eBay. Um, I just went and ordered a batch of them and hoped for the best. And as far as I can tell, these are all series three, being the Doctor and Martha. And this is a little bit of a trip down memory lane for me because I collect. I was an avid collector of Battles in Time up till I'm sure I collected them up till series four. Uh, some of these cards I don't remember. Some of them I recognise quite a lot. So I just thought we'd go through them and talk a little bit about them. And if you do like this kind of video, let me know because I'm considering buying a pack of Harry Potter top trumps. I know I did Harry Potter top trumps before, but I really want to get the Deathly Hallows Part One ones. So if it is something itchy you knows, something you'd like to see. Let me know and if you also want other Doctor Who based videos, suggestions are always, always welcome. So we have Carrier Night One, um, Morgan Stern, who I don't remember. I've only ever, confession time, I've only ever seen series three once all the way through once because I don't like it that much. Um, I've seen certain episodes like Gridlock, I've seen loads, um, but in terms of watching it all I've only seen it once and I haven't seen any of the episodes in about four or five years. Uh, I know I'm an awful awful person but I just I don't, I don't like it that much. Then we have New New York Businessman, card 387 beautiful Carrie Mulligan, Sally Sparrow. It says, this photographer got more than she bargained for for when she visited Wester Drumlands. It contained four killer statues, who of course turned out to be the now very iconic Weeping Angels. Then we have another one that I particularly enjoy, Lilith. See, I love Lilith as a character. She's one of my favourite elements of series 3. And her card says, One of three Carrionites manipulating Shakespeare's words, Lilith sometimes took on human form to blend in better. Pharmacist 1. Toclophane. I still, you know, I, I wrote a Doctor Who script. When I was like 12, I got a Blue Peter badge for it, and um, I must have been older than 12 because I was 13 when I started watching it. Uh, and I created this character called the Astrovoid, and they were these spherical beings that released toxic gas. And they looked identical to the Toclophane. And a year later, the Toclophane came along. All I'm saying is BBC had my script before the Toclophane were in existence. <laughs> Judy and Trooper 1. Had her talk shave came. Albert Dumfries. Weeping Angel 2. Then we have Martha's sister, Tish, with a rather amusing. Lazarus. Sally Calypso. William Shakespeare, whose card says, author of some of the best plays ever, this genius writer helped the doctor find the words to get rid of the carrionites. We have a lovely skull and candle there, which I think is very, very pretty. Talk of 
been attacking. Dalek embryo, which says your opponent has to show you any Dalek cards in their hand. Do you know, I never ever actually learned how to play these. I didn't care. I just collected them because they were beautiful. Macra grip. Vortex manipulator teleport. Barrelman and tenant. I mean, that's a stunning, stunning card, isn't it? Devashed. Pig Slave 2. See, I look at that and I don't see the episode, I just see the 5 inch figure. Macra 2. Lady Thaw. It's quite a nice card. I like the look of that one. But again, that image of <laughs> Lazarus. Tom Milligan. Let me rearrange myself. <laughs> I'm <in> my pyjamas. <laughs> it's a great thing about doing YouTube videos. I can have pyjama bottoms on and then it's brilliant. The Scarecrow one from the Family of Blood. One of my favourite episodes. It's weird because like the episodes that I don't like in series 3, like the Lazarus experiment, I don't like. I genuinely don't care for them. The ones that I do like, like Gridlock and the Family of Blood, I love. It's really bizarre. Then we have Thespian, our Shakespearean actor. Empire State Building Foreman. Professor Lazarus Resurrected. My foot's gone to sleep. It hurts. <laughs> Wallpaper warning. Mutant attack. Jadoon ship. I don't know how I feel about the Jadoon. Smith and Jones is an episode I didn't for the tune as, as creatures I think are quite interesting. Door hacker. No idea what I'm gonna do with these cards after these videos. I don't I don't keep material stuff if I don't need them so I don't know what I'm gonna do with these. I'm gonna give them to a friend. I could learn how to play them. <laughs> Macro We have the Archangel Network. Nothing depressing about this card. Refugee group. I like this one. Father of mine. Hands up, how many people call their relatives father of mine, mother of mine, sister of mine, brother of mine? I do it. I know other people who do it. That episode has just tormented everyone. Jean. Richard Burbage, with a lovely, lovely crown whose card says, This famous actor didn't realise that his lines in Love's Labour's One would unleash the Carrionites onto the world. Human Dalek 3. Julia Swales. <laughs> Tiny, wimey detector. Guys, plasma vote. So I can still see the straw. 
Yeah, I haven't seen the episode in years, but I can still see that straw in the human body drinking the blood. Human Dalek army. I don't know how many of there are here, by the way. There are quite a lot of them. Erin Alisak, who I have no memory of. Leo Jones. Wiry woman. Look at those teeth. Incredible. William Shakespeare under Carrie Nine Influence. And we have the lovely Lilith just peeking over there. Mr. Diagoras. Mr. Phillips. Some beautiful scarecrows. I think we're coming up to my favourite card. I have looked through these because I had to put them in order of number. I did um, consider resisting the temptation to look through them until this video, but I couldn't resist. Time Lord Noahs. Gamma Strike. They're in a very weird order as well. Did you do them for three? Like they're not in episode order or anything. Laszlo. And then one of my favourites. Tim Latimer. Look at the size of Brody Sangster. Look at how small he looks. So adorable. This was my first experience of his acting and just hooked from there. This schoolboy had the spooky ability to see the future after he had heard the doctor's special fob watch talking to him. Ah, oh, just look at it. Such a beautiful card. Crete. Was that the one? I remember watching an episode of um, Totally Doctor Who where there was a competition to be to play this character. I'm sure that was that one. John Smith. Such a beautiful man. Sleep badge. Chipped TARDIS key. Does the TARDIS key still look like that? Or have they changed it now? Carry a night flight. Love the cabin lights. Saxon campaign. Judy Lindsay. Peter Street. Family of blood. I still can't see a red balloon without getting a bit creeped out. I love the family of blood. Chando. Time Lord 2. Carry a knife group. I must have mentally blocked out this episode. The SS Pantalion. Definitely mentally blocked that one out. You pig slips. Hutchinson. And her lovely scarecrow lurking in the background. Talk the pain group, which I still swear were based on my astro. I used to have a YouTube video of the Astrofight as well, but it doesn't exist anymore, unfortunately. <laughs> Refugees too. Lindley. Oh, 
Honesty Mood Patch. Compensation for. Vivian Rook's message. And lastly, President Winters. I enjoyed that more than I should have done for an almost 24 year old. Oh, it's a lot of fun though, it really is. Yeah. So tempted to go on eBay and buy more, but I must resist. But if you do like this video and you do want me to do more similar videos, either Doctor Who based videos or card based videos, please let me know. As I would love to do them. Um, I like to get hold of some series 1 and 2 ones because they're the ones I remember most so they'll bring back a lot of memories a lot of nostalgia oh the stickers, I wonder if I could get the stickers from the sticker books but like loose rather than in the book that would be quite interesting the other like my favourite years ever 2006-2007 the height of my Doctor Who obsession <laughs> Let me know what you think of this video. Thank you for watching. Um, please feel free to discuss Doctor Who in the comments and I shall speak to you all soon. Bye.